Hello friends, I'm Parways and this is our fourth video in Python Flask web development for absolute beginners. Uh, in the previous video, uh, we have learned about uh, reading and writing cookies in Flask. Uh, in this video, we are going to talk about Jinja 2 templating in Flask. So uh, now I'm going to open my PyCharm ID and I want to show you the practical example of uh, using Jinja template in Flask. Uh, so friends, uh, first of all, what is Jinja? Now, uh, Jinja is a, a Python template engine. Um, it's a template engine in Python programming language. And by using Jinja template, we can easily define uh, dynamic blocks of HTML. Now, if you remember from the first video that we have created our web application, and in here we have hard-coded the text, uh, just we have returned this text. But instead of doing this, we can render uh, a template, HTML template in Flask. So now let me show you uh, an example of this. Uh, I'm going to just copy uh, this code. This is my just uh, basic code. And uh, let me just move this port. Mm, okay. Now, first you need to uh, import a render template and uh, uh, for this uh, in our project structure so in here uh, first we need to create uh, templates so make sure that uh, the uh, you need to give uh, this spelling so templates now in here we can add our index.html so let me just first add index.html okay now after creating index.html now let me create uh, HTML so this is HTML and we have a head. Now in the head, uh, let me uh, title add, mm, for example, home. And uh, so no, this is head, sorry. Now in the head, let me add a title, uh, title. And now in here, I'm going to add home. After this, let me create my body. And in the body, I'm going to create an h1 tag. So, welcome to the home page. Okay. Now, this is uh, my HTML. Uh, how you can render this anywhere in text, in your Flask. So, in here, I'm going to just remove this. And in here, I can add render template. And in this section, you need to add your template name. So, it's index.html. Okay. Now after this, I'm going to uh, run my application. So now it is uh, restarting. Now I am waiting. Okay, now if I click on this. So now this is my browser and I will see Okay, page not found. Let me just check uh, the URL. So it is app.route and uh, index.html. So app.flask, app.route. Um, uh, so let me save this. And let me just so let me so now you can see that welcome to the home page. So now this is from our uh, this index that HTML that we have uh, created in this section. Welcome to the home page. So let me add a paragraph in here. So uh, this is the home page, the home page for the website okay now let me just save this and I'm going to now you can see that this is uh, the home page for uh, the website also you can add more so let me just uh, in here create another uh, so for example def news and uh, first let me uh, create my route so app dot route and this is for news you can check my video on dynamic routing so now you can simply return 
render template and I want my template name for example uh, this is uh, uh, news headline.html okay now let me just copy this and let me create a new uh, so in my templates I'm going to create a new file and this is .html and in here uh, let me just copy my this code and paste in here so this is for uh, for the the title is news headline and uh, welcome to the news headline and in here I can write so uh, this is news headline okay now I'm going to refresh my page so after this I want oh, what was my let me just check this so this is news I want to go to the news and now you can see welcome to the news and this is a news headline so thank you guys uh, this was for uh, templates if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos subscribe the channel like the videos and share the video